Welcome to Average Joe's Pool. Now, if you're struggling with your pool stroke and don't really know how to go about getting it straightened out, then we may well have the perfect gadget for you. This is compatible with all Android and iOS devices. This is the QMD3 Pool Stroke Analyzer. So the QMD3 has been kindly supplied to us by Mosens, which is the owner of QMD for review. If you've not heard of Mosens before, they are a specialist manufacturer of pool products. They manufacture the Clean Gleam, which is a pool ball cleaning machine, as well as what we have here, the QMD3 pool stroke analyzer. And as the name may well suggest, the QMD3 is an electronic training aid specifically designed to help you analyze your own pool stroke during play. And when you buy a QMD3, it does come in a carry case complete with a USB charging cable. And then you'll need to download the app, which is available completely free of charge on both the Play and Apple stores. And as for the unit itself, as you can see, it is a very small box. We have a white lid on a transparent box. Uh, one side of the box is open and that gives you access to the power switch. And on the side of the box, we also have the USB port for the charging cable. This attaches onto your queue via a Velcro strap. And on the underside of the box, we also have a rubberized channel that not only protects your queue, but also ensures that the box is held firmly in place. And you may have also noticed these two uh, handle caps that we have here. This is a brand new addition. This is not even on the QMD website yet at the time of recording this video. This product's coming soon. We've got a sneak preview of it. We'll be taking a look at these a little bit later on in the video. And the QMD3 comes supplied complete with a full 12 month warranty. And if you are interested in buying one of these, they're only available direct from the QMD website. Current price on these is $179. So now we know a little bit more about the QMD3, it's time to start testing it. And all products here at Average Joe's Pool have a minimum of five hours use on the table to ensure that we can form an accurate and fair review. Let's go. First superhero from New Jersey, even better. Now the way that this works is the software wants to see a nice straight stroke. So if you're moving backwards and forwards, through your stroke, it'll be analyzing how straight that stroke actually is. And if the software detects it coming off to either the left or the right hand side off of center, it will chirp at you. It has two different noises, one for left and one for right. So to give you a demonstration of that, when the stroke's nice and straight, all we hear is the uh, constant beep. However, if I then come off to my right, Or if we do the left, we will get a different noise. It's worth noting that the stroke analyzer also records the elevation of the cue as well. Now you won't have any beep warnings for the elevation because it depends on what shot you're training for as to the elevation of the cue. However, it will pick that elevation up in the software. So if we're coming in high and driving it through, it should also pick that change of elevation up when you come to analyze the shot. So let's start off with a nice, simple, straight shot. I'll keep this cue as straight as I can. So this time I'm purposely gonna pull to my right during the backstroke and then straighten up as I follow back through. So this time I'm going to do the same thing to the opposite side during the backstroke. I'm going to bring it over to the side and then straighten it up as I follow through. And then this time we'll try a test for elevation. Uh, so on the uh, backstroke, I'm going to be bringing the cue upward and then pushing it down as I come through. And 
for this next shot, I'm going to test for wrist rotation. So as I come through the shot, I'm going to do a slight twist onto the cue. People have just got to be stopped. When it comes to performance, I must say I was absolutely fascinated by the QMD3. And I was very surprised the level of information that you're able to get out of this tiny little unit. And what we have here is a training device that can definitely be applicable to all skill levels of players. At its most basic level, if you're a beginner and you're finding that your stroke is deviating, this thing will pick that up really, really quickly and it will give you those beeps to help you straighten it up. So with a little bit of practice, you can easily iron out those kind of major kinks. So from that perspective, if you are a relative beginner when it comes to pull and you are struggling a little bit, yes, without question, this will be an extremely useful tool. However, when it comes to more experienced players, this thing can also be extremely useful, but in a slightly different way. Because if you are an experienced player, the chances are your stroke is going to be relatively straight. And this is where the QMD really excels, because yes, of course, it does measure the straightness of your stroke, but it goes far beyond that. Because one of the more advanced side of the stroke that the QMD3 can help you with is your stroke consistency. So let's say, for example, that you are a more experienced player and you already have a nice and straight stroke. Well, then a good drill for you would be to set up an identical shot on the table and play that shot through 10 times. And then go to the app and analyze each of those 10 shots for consistency. Because in that metric section, you're gonna find all types of useful information, including the speed of your backstroke, the pause, and then the speed of your follow through. And you'll also be able to see it in graph form where it compares each of those 10 shots. Now what you're ideally looking for, of course, if you do 10 identical shots, you're looking to get that information as close as possible between all of those 10 shots. So even if you do have a really straight stroke, there are probably other inconsistencies that this thing can help you analyze and hopefully iron out. So when it comes to the actual app for the QMD3, it must be said it is a very functional and overall a very decent app. It is a little bit clunky around the edges, but thankfully all of the key information, the information that relates to what your cue is actually doing is all there, all working and spot on. And one of the little niggles that we had with the app is we couldn't actually find a way to stop your current session. So let's say, for example, you wanted to do a very specific session, you wanted to analyze 10 stop shots. And what you should be able to do is go ahead and do those 10 stop shots. And when you get to the end of that session, there should be an option to stop session, but it's not there. But why not simply have a stop session button right there in the practice section? And one really useful feature we found uh, when using this, of course, you do get those beeps and those chirps as you move the cue around, and that can be a little bit annoying. However, if you angle the cue upwards more than 45 degrees, those chirps automatically stop. So that can be really useful and certainly stop those chirps getting on your nerves when you're not actually using the unit. So overall, from a performance perspective, the QMD3 definitely has blown me away. It does exactly what I expected it to with regards to stroke straightness. The basic stuff, it does that very easily. However, it's the more advanced stuff where this really shines. And it's really nice to see a tool that can be used by all levels of players for different reasons. And another feature like I promised I mentioned are these butt cap attachments that allow you to slide the unit inside and then attach this on to the end of the butt of your cue. Now in principle, of course, that's fantastic because it helps keep that little unit completely out of the way. However, from a performance perspective, having played around with these, uh, there is an inherent issue. And that is the simple fact that the QMD unit itself actually sticks out of the end of this cap. 
Now you may well think as I did, well I'll just be super careful and make sure that I don't actually put the cue down on the floor, I'll keep it on the table. And then of course within two minutes of attaching this onto my cue, I went to chalk my cue, put the butt straight down on the floor. Now thankfully no damage was done to the QMD unit itself. However, this could be easily rectified just by making this just another 10 or 12 millimeters longer. And hopefully that's what they'll do when they actually release these to the general public. But otherwise, what we have here is definitely a good idea. And this may well be the preferred solution for many people. So with all that in mind, let's go ahead and score the QMD3 for performance. The QMD3 definitely seemed to perform very well and be very reactive to different cue motions. And whilst we're not 100% certain that it would be able to pick up the very finest of tiny motions, it did actually seem surprisingly sensitive. And couple that with a pretty decent app and a simple beep monitoring system and you have a tool that not only works well but is also easy to use. It may not be perfect but it's definitely a solid performer, scoring the QMD3 a solid four stars out of five for performance. When it comes to quality, our little QMD3 unit here is a very well-made unit. However, it should be said that the unit definitely does have a slightly unfinished feel to it. For example, on the one end where the power switch is located, that end is completely open. And additionally, they have missed a trick by not having their logo on the unit. Now, it's far from being bad quality. It is very, very well made. However, it does have a slightly kind of prototype feel to it. But we do have to remember that this is a very specialist product and QMD, no doubt, are not going to be making these by the hundreds of thousands. They're probably going to be making these in batches of hundreds. So it is very, very specialist. And a feature that I really appreciated is the rubber channel that we have on the rear of the unit. It's nice to see that QMD have taken that extra step just to ensure that not only this unit sits nice and firmly on the queue, but also helps prevent cause any damage or scratches. And moving on to the quality of the app itself, I must say that overall I was very impressed. I really like the animations that are available there from three different angles and also the fact that you can view those frame by frame. And in addition to the animation, you also get a graph that helps illustrate exactly how your shot travels from the backstroke through to your pause through to the forward stroke. So there's definitely a lot of attention to detail when it comes to the features that are included in the app. And it provides a wealth of information that you really can spend hours going over. You can truly geek out. And when it comes to the butt cap holders that we have here, it must be said that the overall quality on these is definitely not the best. But we do have to remember that these are probably prototypes, so these may well change by the time these actually come on sale to the general public. The overall finish on these, they do appear as if they've been maybe printed on some kind of 3D printer or something like that. They are quite soft, they are quite flexible. Uh, but the finish, you know, if you look in the uh, hole there, is actually uh, quite rough. And so again, with these butt cap holders, uh, they definitely have a very prototype feel. And the quality of these is not up to the quality of the main unit itself. Like I said, this may well change when these come out and become available for the general public. So let's go ahead and score the QMD3 for quality. Overall, the quality of the QMD3 is good. And whilst the main unit maybe appears to be a touch unfinished or prototype in nature, it is clearly very well made from high quality components. And it definitely feels solid and substantial. The accompanying app won't blow you away with outstanding flashy visuals, but it has been well designed and is very functional. So we'll score the QMD3 a respectable three and a half stars out of five for quality. When it comes to value for money, the QMD3 is definitely quite a hard beast to judge. It is a very specialist product and has very little in the way of competition. So what's this actually worth? Well, it must be said that at $179, the QMD3 is definitely not cheap. My personal feeling for a product such as this, the ideal price point would be around $99. And if QMD3 were selling hundreds of thousands of these a year, I'm sure they would be $99. However, what we have here is a very, very specialist tool, manufactured no doubt in small quantities. And so unfortunately you do have to pay a slight premium. 
However, when it comes to competitors in the very niche stroke analyzer market, there really is very little competition for this. The only real competitor for the QMD3 is the DigiQ Blue. And the DigiQ Blue is pretty much identical to this with regards to price. However, it's not actually currently available and seems to go in and out of production. And so from that perspective, the pricing on this is directly in line with its competing products. And another way of looking at it, if this thing does actually help you straighten out your pool stroke, how many lessons with a professional pool coach would $180 buy you? The answer, not very many. And quite interestingly, this unit is probably capable of picking up very, very small defects in a stroke that you probably wouldn't be able to spot just by looking at it with the naked eye. So if you're watching your own stroke in a mirror or maybe standing behind someone and watching their stroke, if you've got a deviation that's only very, very small, you might not even catch it when you're looking at it. However, this thing probably would. And at the end of the day, if this thing helps you perfect your stroke and makes you a better pool player, then it's got to be worth every cent of $180. So let's go ahead and score this for value for money. Whilst it would be nice to see the QMD3 come in a touch cheaper, it would be hard to argue that you're not actually getting a lot for your money. And when all is said and done, we have a specialist tool that when used correctly, seems to be very capable of actually improving your pool stroke. And for many players, the value of that improvement would far outweigh the cost of this unit. So we're happy to award the QMD3 with a solid four stars out of five for value. And so finally, we need to award the QMD3 with an official Average Joe's rating. And to do this, we simply take the scores from across our three test categories, and then we calculate the average. And this gives the QMD3 an official Average Joe's rating of 3.8 stars. A very deserving and solid score for an extremely useful training aid. And if you're not confident in your stroke, then the QMD3 could prove a very wise investment. So there we have it, that is the QMD Pool Stroke Analyzer. This is definitely not a toy, this is a very, very capable tool to help you improve your game. And remember, if you are interested in buying one of these, they are available to buy direct from the QMD website, and we will add a link to that website in the video description for you. So thank you for joining us here at Average Joe's Pool. If this video has been entertaining or helpful for you, can you at the very, very least take one second out of your busy schedule? Please be sure to hit that like button for us. Likewise, whilst you're there, why not also hit that subscribe button and switch on notifications to find out about all of our upcoming videos. So thank you once again. And just remember, if you build it, he will come.